Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Well, I have a Goose Creek haul to share with you. Um, this was something that I ordered when I was away visiting a uh, family. And of course, here it is. I'm so excited to share it with you. So I'm going to open this box and I will be right back. So yeah, I had a wonderful time visiting my family, but um, I was missing my wax. <laughs> I don't know about you guys, when you go out of town or you go on vacation and and you can't warm your wax like you normally do, you know, or any of that stuff, you have these, I go through withdrawals, you know. I had one wax warmer downstairs in Rachel's, um, in a bedroom that Rachel had for me downstairs at, at her house, and it was perfect. Um, but when I went to visit my other daughter, Hillary, um, they're kind of scent sensitive, I guess, and they have other family members that are extremely, they go into like coughing fits. Um, it's her mother-in-law. She really, really struggles and I feel bad for her. So to be respectful, I don't now take any of my wax warmers or anything to Hillary's house because I just don't want to, you know, I don't want anything to happen. So I went through withdrawals. So what do you do when you're on vacation is you order wax you know if, if you can't warm it you order it you know and Goose Creek had an most amazing sell on their candles it was on their Easter candles and I got them for seven dollars and 99 cents so okay so I'm going to finish opening this and I'll be right back okay so these are very well packed this was on top and this is like cardboard and you can put more candles in here for stacking so and so here are my candles. I ordered six. I don't know if you can see these. Try to lift them. But I ordered six. So I'm going to take these out and we'll get going. Okay. Some of these, like the lids, were just a little bit off jar and off balance, I guess. I could smell the goodies inside. None of these are broken, so I'm super excited about that. So, here we go. I'm going to start with, like I said, these were Easter candles, and so they were blowing them out for $7.99. But I went on the website this morning, and it looks like they're now $13.99. So, they're still there. So, this was a really good deal. I did also notice this morning that their wax melts are on sale for $3. And I know a year ago, if I would have said they're on sale for $3, you would have said... That's not a great sell. It's not the best for two ounces of wax, but it is what it is. Prices have gone up everywhere, all over the world. We are facing inflation. Um, so yeah, don't get me started. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to start with Hungry Bunny Trail Mix. It's honey, Hungry Bunny Trail Mix. And here it is. It's like a pastel pink jar and this is a candle it's white wax I'm not really smelling a whole lot this is super light I might have to chop this one and use it as wax melts it's very very light now I do have a really strong candle going in the background I've got a um, lilac candle that I picked up from our local um, gift, gift shop or whatever. So I think I might move that and I'll be right back. Okay, back to the candle. Yeah, it's really, really light. So I'm cold. I'm going to give it a thumbs down. But the scent notes of this are crispy rice treats. So like Rice crispy Treats. Um, almond milk, strawberry, toffee, and vanilla. Now the one thing that I can pull out of here is the almond milk and the toffee. That's the only thing I'm getting. It's kind of almost like a caramelized, I guess toffee is kind of a caramel. But that's the strongest note I smell right now. So we'll see what happens if I warm it. I might chop this one. I don't know if I'm going to burn it, but that is Hungry Bunny Trail Mix. But you know, for $7.99, it's all good. Okay, Honey Crisps. This is from their cereal collection. 
This one caught my eye. That's the white wax. Now this one I can smell. It smells like honey and vanilla. That's what it smells like to me, like a beautiful vanilla with a honey. Yeah. And this one is honey butter, crunchy cereal, and vanilla. So yeah, that's what I get out of this one. Okay. The next one is peanut butter crisps. This is also from their cereal line. I'm just going in the order that they were on my um, packing slip. Definitely peanut butter. Oh, this one's good. This one really does taste or smell like peanut butter cereal, peanut butter crisp or whatever. Oh yeah, this smells really good. It's hot cocoa, peanut butter, chocolate, vanilla, cereal, and powdered sugar. There is a hint of cocoa, but I smell peanut butter cereal and cocoa maybe. Oh, this smells really, really good. So there's that one. Okay, the next one is, um, let's see, where is it? Jelly bean icing. Oh, that is cute. That is very festive with Easter. But I just like what's inside. Oh, this one's nice. This is like a sweet uh, jelly bean with bakery. Yeah, you got jelly beans and bakery. It smells like I'm in a bake shop and there's a big bowl of jelly belly, jelly beans. And I'm smelling those and then I can smell some other goodies in the back like somebody just frosted a cake. Yeah, that's what this smells like. It's making my mouth water. So the scent notes on this one are, um, let's see. Lemon marshmallow, sugar, and vanilla cream. Yeah, I guess I could, but it still smells like, I guess they are a lemon jelly bean. Yeah, they are. It's like a lemon jelly bean, but it also smells like you're in a bake shop and you can smell cakes being frosted. <laughs> Seriously. So this one is so awesome. It's not real heavy in the throw on cold but you know it might change when you warm it so there is that one okay the next one is called bird nest cookie I just love the packaging on this one and I know Easter is over but it still gives me spring vibes so yeah oh this one's very much a bakery I can smell cookies I can smell cookies. Um, even a hint of peanut, there might be a hint of peanut butter. Maybe chocolate chip. I don't know, but let's read the scent notes. It's toffee cookie, caramel, cream brulee, and chocolate. Oh, that's different. Cream brulee. Caramel cream brulee. It's the toffee. I'm picking up the toffee in the cookie. And there is a caramelized base note about this mm. but it kind of also smells like chocolate chip cookies I can smell the toffee there's just all kinds of yummy things I think every time you smell this you interpret a different kind of cookie almost it's almost like oh I smell this no I smell this there's like more than one thing going on with this and I think I think this would have everybody would have a different idea of what they're smelling but it is definitely a bakery it is definitely a cookie but yeah very good and then last but not least this is the non bakery um, where is it it's kind of like okay it is called where are you it doesn't even have a oh my goodness it doesn't have an outside oh here it is it was clear on the bottom here and I wasn't, I couldn't see it. It is Easter Sunday dress, but that is where the label is and you can't even see this, but that's what it says. 
This is really, really pretty. This is perfumey. This is girly. This is floral. It's clementine, blue freesia, peach, white lily, and sandalwood. Oh, this is really, really pretty. Yes, and Easter Sunday dress totally fits the bill on this one. This, yeah. Yeah, this is really, really pretty. So, yeah. So, this is like my only floral one out of the bunch. But, yeah, I really like it. So, those are my candles. I, I'm trying to pick which one I think would be my favorite. Um, this Honeycrisp one really surprised me. Because I was like, I've just picked a Honeycrisp. It's going to have too much honey. I'm not going to like it. But believe it or not, I think I like this one the best. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? How you think you know you're going to like something and then it turns out it's it's not the, your favorite. But I think this one is out of the bunch. I mean, I like them all, but yeah, I like this one a lot. Honey Crisps. Hey, they still have it on the website. I think they still have all of these candles on the website. It's just that they're, they're not $7.99 today, but that doesn't mean they won't be tomorrow or maybe sometime in the future. Um, if you're with Goose Creek on their email system where they send out emails and totally clog up all your emails <laughs> you'll get the notification um but anyway that is what i picked up i got some more hauls i got some empties i want to share with you you guys i love you guys i love um i was able to meet one of my subscribers over in wyoming i'm super excited and i'm going to be sharing that with you in an upcoming video as soon as i get her permission to share her video just as soon as I get her permission, then I will share, or I'll share her picture. So, anyway, you guys take care. Bye-bye.